All right, if you saw last week's episode, you saw that I had a great conversation with Dom Hegdahl. This is a senior from Fairmont High School. He loves video production and all things technical. He loves sports, he loves music. So him and I connected, we thought, let's do something together. I thought maybe I could kind of, you know, give some advice and and work with him on, on video stuff. And it's been a joy, honestly. So. Check out what Dom came up with. He shot this at Fairmont High School with some students showcasing local talent. Check it out. I'm Bryce Blake. And I'm Craig Gates the second. And we are Thirsties. We are Thirsties. Like the most broadest sense I can put it is just rock and roll music. But we like to combine um, folk in there. We like to add punk and we like to add our classic rock in there. And it's a lot of rhyming too, so we really just like blend them all together to create one unique sound, I believe. That's a good question. That is a good question. <laughs> we're we're going to uh, try to be in the studio all week and record it mm -hmm. and get it down. Hopefully it can be out by Monday, hopefully, but you know. Yeah, and then of course the music video oh, yeah. too. We're going to shoot a music video for it as well. Mm -hmm. that well, won't take too long. Future plans is we want to try to studio record and we want to get more stuff out there. Currently, we do have a YouTube channel where we're posting practices and just like shorter videos ba like based around our music that we are making. We want to try to release an album, maybe like an EP before the semester is over. But, you know, hopefully we can just get register out and done with uh, first studio recording. Personally, Tim Henson from Polyphia, he always been a big inspiration to me. Big guitarist, um, Nirvana, uh, a lot of punk bands personally, a lot of folk, just music in general. Mm -hmm. um, the One of my biggest inspirations uh, for being an artist is Little Darky. He just brings such a unique sound uh, to the table when it comes to like the rap scene, but also in folk music too. You know, if you got the instruments and you got the right things to do what you want to do, do it. Pursue your dreams. Make it. Don't make it a dream. Like stop. Have, stop keeping it a dream. Make it reality. Like join a band. Do what you want. Find who you need for. I was gonna say the same thing. I think it's very important that you like actually go and do it and not just be like, oh man, what if? Because if you're just constantly like just imagining like the sound and like the band name and all that and like who would be a part of it, then you'll actually never get to the point where you're in a studio or you're playing guitar or any instrument for that matter. You'll never actually make it a reality. So for like young people who are like inspiring to be like in any art form really you just gotta put yourself out there and actually do it and don't let anybody tell you that you can't do it uh you can find us on youtube at thirsties you can find us by our personal instagram mm -hmm. all right i appreciate it guys thank you yeah thank yeah. you thanks for having us on all right uh who are you and what do you do uh, so my name is Nathan Billum. Uh, I am from Fairmont High. I like to paint, draw, and I'm pretty artistic, I'd say. You know, one of my friends when I moved here kind of got me into painting, but I mean, overall, artistic-wise, I'd say I started, like, painting and drawing in kindergarten, younger ages, and kind of just grew up with it, so. Well, um... The, the smaller painting there, would uh, I'd say that's probably one of my favorites uh, that took the most time. It's of a sunset, or moon, sorry. This is a moon with a dock coming out onto the beach and reflection of the moon off onto the water shows, I mean, it's just something nostalgic and aesthetic that I thought was pleasing and something that I like. So here's that one. Um, I mean, I'd like to get them out in the social media on different platforms and I mean first I have to come up with names But I kind of want to explore into that kind of 
thing and start selling them maybe possibly and just showing them off and showing other people how I do things with my art. I, I wouldn't really have any awards, mostly just me getting applauds and people liking my paintings on posts. Um, yeah, I'd say Bob Marley would be a pretty big influence on my painting, just like the way he teaches flow work and how like you set up your paintings and what goes through your headspace when you're painting, it kind of sums up how your painting's going to come out. Probably be just to say persistent. I mean, if you're doing artwork, it's not going to be like something that you can do quick and you really got to take time and effort into doing it and have the sum come out the way you want, so. All right, I appreciate it, man. All righty, thank you. Thank you, Dominic. Thank you, everyone featured in that piece. We will be continuing that series showcasing talent in Fairmont and Martin County. So if you have a talent, we want to meet you. Send us a video. Send it to team at cabinshotweekly.com. Send us your talent. We might put you on the show. <laughs>